The Koenigre Urban Transport Plan is an integrated planning and investment tool positioned to deliver solutions tailor made to the transport and mobility challenges in the capital of Guinea. Following the visioning study of Greater Kone Cree 2040, and in collaboration with the Ministries of Transport and Public Works, the Kone Cree Transportation Master Plan presents a range of solutions within a strategic vision that aims to transform current mobility conditions for the people of Kone Cree. Kone Cree faces unprecedented urban and demographic growth with a population that is expected to double and reach more than 5 million people by 2040, all situated within the limited space of a narrow peninsula. In this context, Kone Cree experiences increasing traffic and congestion, which is one of the main obstacles to its economic development, quality of life and accessibility to various parts of the city. The objective of the Transportation Master Plan is to transform Konikri into a polycentric and decentralized city, develop a mass transit network, guarantee good accessibility to every community, and to shift freight traffic from road to rail. The development of a mass transit system is prioritized to ensure fluidity of all traffic flows within the agglomeration. The planning focuses on the achievement of a multimodal network, which includes First, a reinforced railway system, on the CBK line featuring a dual railway between Kalum and Kaplan, construction of new urban railway stations, and increasing the number of modern urban trains, running on the network. The creation of a bus rapid transit, BRT, network connecting Kalum, the Avenue Le Prince and the Northern Waterfront Road, with reserve bus lanes and fully equipped and secured BRT stations, which separate the bi-articulated buses from road traffic. Taking advantage of the existing rail and road infrastructure, the expansion of the multimodal network will continue phase by phase and allow the development of new metropolitan subcenters in Coloma, Sonfania, Kaplan, and Sonoya. The new administrative, commercial, and industrial functions of these emerging subcenters will enable more spatially balanced mobility needs across the city. The intermodality and synergy between mass transit networks and other public transport services, leading to secondary urban settlements, will support better connectivity and accessibility for all public transport operators that will integrate into the network. To unlock urban districts and settlements with low accessibility, the Transportation Master Plan includes the rehabilitation of Kone Cree's main arteries and the creation of a network of secondary streets and roads. All street networks to rebuild are identified on the base of the existing urban layout and of accessibility needs of urban populations. Traffic plans have been developed for each sector, encouraging a better distribution of traffic flows within and between neighborhoods, away from the main avenues of the city. The renewal of Kalum, the historical city center of Konikri, will include a local traffic plan that will apply one-way traffic to all streets, a careful protection of pedestrian spaces, and coordinated parking management. Trucks will be forbidden in the streets of the city centers, thanks to a shift in freight traffic from trucks to the railway network. Furthermore, the main passenger railway station will be reintegrated at the heart of Kaloum. It will become a complete multimodal hub that is connected to the BRT network of Konikri.
pedestrians, are the primary mobility mode in Konakri and requires special attention. The transportation master plan achieves this, by creating dedicated pedestrian axes, and by improving road safety conditions, at main road intersections, and on every street of the city. The pedestrian master plan envisions the development, of a complete network of pedestrian green alleys, connecting all districts of Konikri. Konikri must also restore the balance, between free traffic and people's mobility, and to find strategic synergies, at the technical and institutional levels. By shifting the freight traffic from the roads to railways, the transportation master plan supports the prior development of the Triport of Kanklin and a new main city market in the Sanoya area. Achieving sustainable and healthy mobility in Konikri will not happen without the creation of a metropolitan transport authority. This authority must be able to implement the transportation master plan in a comprehensive way and to regulate tomorrow's public transport modes, leading to a better future of the capital of Guinea, shaped by mobility, for all.